Hey everyone, it's Joanne here with a work in progress. I uh, recently put together a new three-tiered tray and um, was asked to show in a video how I planned on styling it. So with that in mind, I put out an open invitation to anyone who might want to share the styling of their tiered tray as well. And I've had a couple of responses from that open invitation, so I'm very uh, thankful for that. And two ladies to this point that I know um, are participating are Deidre over at The Thrill of the Thrift and Christina at Harker's Place. And I have listed both of their videos in a playlist for this particular uh, share. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you what I put together for my tiered tray. That's really hard to say. <laughs> so here we go. I'm going to turn you around a little bit so you can see it better. Pardon the mess in the house, but there is a reason that my channel is called A Work in Progress. So there is a picture of it all together. I'm going to start with the top. Move you a little bit, oops, sorry about that. Move you a little bit closer here so you can see. And you may remember these little guys. This was, um, these were all in a basket, or I'm sorry, in a bag that I had purchased together. And they're all these little teeny tiny little bird houses. So I put together a little bird house city here and placed it at the top of my tiered tray. And you can see that the tray is moving around. Uh, what I did just to show you folks, make it easier to show you, I placed the tiered tray on a Lazy Susan. Now had I been really smart like Deidre over at the Thrill of the Thrift, she actually made her, her biggest tray on the bottom. It, she used a Lazy Susan. I thought that was brilliant because then um, you know she can turn the tray around as she wants to to show off the different sides of it. I just thought that was a great idea. So I'm going to move you back a little bit here so you can see. There we go. The second tray. And here are a couple of the animals that uh, cast iron that I got in a bag of cast iron uh, dogs. And here are the bunny rabbits from a while back. And here I uh, fashioned two, I mean two of them, the farmhouse bead strands. And these beads I uh, bought in a whole bag of them and then just put them on the jute twine and made tassels for them one night when I was watching TV. I'm going to turn around a little bit more and just put in a little bird here, a little red bird in a nest. Uh, that I had uh, purchased a while back just to use in crafting and that sort of thing. And then these, you may remember a couple of pieces from a bag that I purchased. Uh, this little globe actually turns around. I thought that was really pretty cool. And here we just have a little basket with some flowers in it. And then the final bottom tray, I have to move you out here for that. And here we have another piece from that basket. And here we have a couple of little ceramic kitty cats. This little, these little guys are hiding behind the tassels. I've got all of those in a bag not too long ago as well. And this is just a little uh, cream and sugar that I purchased not too long ago. And then over here, a couple of Dollar Tree flowers that are inside of a hay little bathtub that came with the rest of uh, some of those pieces. Here's my little cow that you might remember from not too long ago. He has a little bell on him. I thought he was super cute. Another little piece from that uh, bag that I bought. This actually is a um, pencil sharpener and the little birdie goes in and out. It's super, super cute. And we're back to our kitty cats. So that's it for the styling of my three-tiered tray. I do think that I am going to change it out with the seasons or kind of my mood, you know, whatever kind of suits me at the time. Well, that is it. If you enjoy the styling or you might have some ideas 
on uh, um, how you might have done it, go ahead and leave a comment down below. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up so that I know. And that is it for today, guys. And uh, until next time, take very good care of yourselves, and I will see you very soon, okay? Till then, bye-bye.